it's tough. Uh, how does that uh, hat feel on your head? Uh, it feels great. I mean, I love the hat. <laughs> how long are you planning on wearing it? Uh, probably the rest of the day. Never know. I feel like Bama was really my best for me. At first, I didn't think so because I just let people get in my head, but it's probably the best school out there, really. It just felt like home as soon as I got there. You know, the players, the players treated me good. The coach is cool. I just love it. I remember the first time I went to a signing day. I know it was when Coach McGee was here. I was like, I can't wait to like have a, have my own signing day and be able to sign my papers or whatever. And it just it shows that time flies. Does it really set in that you're going to maybe the the biggest program in, in the nation, or is now when it sets in? Uh, I think now that it sets in, that I'm I'm probably gonna win national championships, and that's like a different feeling. And I'm probably part of the, like the biggest and best class to like ever come to Alabama. So that's like great to know. The coaches told me how nobody's starting at all. So I could come in, really compete right away. And I found out a lot of the guys that are ahead of me are like juniors and they moving a lot of people around so I can play. So that's something I'm looking forward to. But mainly with me, just getting a degree, playing around great guys, great coaches, and just learning to be a man. Got to work harder than everything I do. Practice to the club and to the weight room. I just got to work hard. Just work hard at all, part, all parts of my game. And that, and that should be okay. I know recently, like the past couple of weeks, Notre Dame came to the house, Louisville. It was crazy. Bama, Bama fans were really worried. I was like, you guys have nothing to worry about at all. That's a good reason why I'm going up there too, because I know some folks up there already, and they were cool down here. So some folks going to be coming up there with me. They run the same defense we run, and he's sending players to the NFL. So um, I expect it to be hard, but I can do it. I can do it. <laughs> when you saw that uh, interception the Patriots made the other night, what went through your mind? Man, they blew it. <laughs> Seahawks blew it. I was going for the Seahawks. I don't know why they ain't running in. Is that something you think you can do in the oh, yeah, Easy. <laughs> easy. Uh, I feel like I wasn't the only guy who recruited. Me and Blake Barnett teamed up with a lot of guys to like, try to get them on campus. And it worked. I mean, Blake Barnett is probably like a figurehead for the class, me and him. So everybody wants to play with him. Yeah. Now that you've officially signed with Alabama, are you still going to be attending math class this year? No. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be practicing against probably Travion Samuel, right? Oh, yeah. A kid from here. Uh, he's pretty quick. What are you, uh, do you have any, are you have any uh, ideas how you're going to try to tackle that kid? He looks like he bounces around a lot. <laughs> We're going to see what happens. We're going to see what happens doing right? How annoying do you think it was to play tag against that kid when he was little? Oh, it, it was hard. You know he quit. It was, it was real hard. <laughs> but if you get him, you got him. I mean, I'm in the gym every day because of it. And I want to prove a lot of people wrong. It appears that you may have some lipstick on your right cheek. Who, uh, <laughs> who planted that on you? <laughs> uh, my aunts, me and my aunt took a picture and they kissed me on the cheek. <laughs> <laughs> it's sparkly. Oh, yeah.